Hey guys, Someday Travels here. Just to let you guys know what this channel is about, I do a lot of travel videos, but I'm also a huge bourbon connoisseur. So I've been uh, testing out a bunch of different bourbons. I'm gonna share some of my everyday drinkers, but also while I'm on these trips, I'm gonna find the best whiskeys and compare them to our bourbons that we have here in the States compared to the best whiskeys or the, just the best alcoholic beverage I can find while I'm doing my travels overseas. I've been to a lot of places already, uh, Thailand, I've been to Everest up there in Nepal, Kathmandu, India, did the Taj Mahal, uh, things of that nature. So I figured, you know, why not on these travel trips, I'm going to try to bring you this travel, but why not also try to bring you some of the great specialty drinks that I'm going to see in these other places. I also will share with you some amazing bourbons along the way and some of my favorites. Uh, right here, I don't think the camera's focused in, but I'll show you. I mean, I'm a huge Eagle Rare fan. Down here, we can get this stuff for around 40 to 60 bottles, bottles, bucks, depending on where you know we find it at, what stores, and if you make the right connections. I know some of you boys that live outside the tri-state area here, which my area is Memphis, Tennessee. When I say tri-state area, I'm talking Arkansas, Mississippi, and Tennessee. Some of the boys on the outside of that area are paying up to 100 to 150 dollars a bottle for some Eagle Rare. Across the country, I'd be curious if you guys can even find this or. What are you guys giving for a bottle of Eagle Rare? What does that guy run you guys? All right, uh, but I'm gonna go over some really good bottles too. Of course, you know, everybody wants to talk about the uh, the Pappies and the Rip Van Winkles and stuff. We've got that stuff. I've got a little bit of everything, guys, but each week I'll try to open up a new bottle and we'll go over a fancy bottle and I'll tell you what I think of it. I don't have the great nose and the great palate, but I'll give you the common boy thing. The real, is it good, is it garbage compared to the common guy, what I think. And also, I'm going to compare it to the stuff I see internationally. See what you guys think. Uh, real quick, my everyday drinkers, I love me some Knob's Creek. Now, this is a nine-year single barrel, of course, but usually just your $40 single barrel select for Knob's Creek. I love to drink that is on my daily something i just found that i really do enjoy that's pretty reasonably priced is new riff new riff is a great bourbon for an everyday drinker or everyday sipper uh, i'm gonna crack some of these bottles in later on videos so please subscribe and like because we're gonna open up all kinds of stuff even some kentucky owl i'm gonna break into that i think i even got some 15 year whistle pig here uh oh yeah there you go some 15 year whistle pig We'll crack these open. I'll give you my opinion on them. And I'll give you the opinion on the type of feeling they give you afterwards, too. But it's going to be really fun to go internationally on some of these trips that I'm going to be going and trying some of these drinks and just showing you some of those activities. So I don't really have a niche, sort of say, like they tell me you got to have on YouTube. I don't have a production crew. I don't have people working with me. It's just me, my GoPro, and my phone. And I'm going to go out and I'm going to try to capture as much for you guys as I can on all these international travel trips I got going on and also every bourbon and drink that I run across on, on those travels. So please subscribe, help me grow, follow me. You can critique me also. Tell me what I need to change. This place will be changing. This is my place at the lake at Pickwick and uh, I got to take this wall down and everything, but I'll be putting it back up at the house and try to get a good little studio environment so I can bring you guys some great drinks, all right? But hope you're along for the journey. If you wanna travel and meet together for a drink, just comment, send me an email, we'll touch base, and we'll try to make this thing grow and try to make it as best we can. All right, live, love, dream, stay safe, till I see you again. Peace out.